What is going on, ARMY? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, we're going to be taking a look at the visualizer for Neuron. We've already watched the music video. Now we're just going to now we're just gonna enjoy the visualizer. So let's do that now. I'll tell you again. We'll never ever give up forever. i say it again. We'll always be a light to move on. He's in this, but not the music video? Oh, okay. This isn't a visualizer, bro. It's much more than just a visualizer. It's fire, though. I also got to say real quick, right over here. <clears throat> I know when I I don't know when all these 
clips are taking place, but in the beginning they were obviously specifying specific dates <clears throat> from dance practices. That was fun to see in the very, very beginning. Uh, and I do want to talk about, I don't want to forget about talking about this specific part when he's walking uh, over here. So I, I really don't want to forget because I want to talk about something broader. Uh, but the shirt that he's wearing over here, I know when he, I know when this was taking place. This is when they were, this is when McDonald's was doing the, the collaboration. I have the collaboration somewhere. I have this collaboration. I can't remember. It's Cactus something, but I know exactly what he's wearing over here. I know exactly. It wasn't that long ago either. Um, you can see a little better over here. I know exactly what this is. I remember going to McDonald's and like really wanting to get this collaboration. This is when they did the first uh, kids meals for McDonald's. Happy meals for adults. They didn't have any boxes except one that was broken. I was like, can I just have the box? And she's like, yeah, whatever. <laughs> This happened a long time ago. This was like last year, but like in the beginning of the year. Cactus Jack, thank you. This was last year, beginning of the year. So this was a while ago. It was. I remember that. Um, I still have the toy, too, that came with it over there. Oh, hold on a second. Give me one second. Give me one second. I'm going to show you, actually, that I have it. Uh, how do I hide my screen? <laughs> hold on a second. <coughs> All right, give me a second. Shut up, Mc Nick and his McDonald's information. Shut up, dude. This is a big deal, actually. It was kind of a big deal. Mocking me, bro. Hold on. <laughs> oh, my God. Nick and his McDonald's knowledge, bro. Whoop. Now I'm dropping everything. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> okay. <coughs> You're going to make fun of me. I'm coughing and dying over here. You ready? You ready? This is the thing. This is what he's wearing. Where's my mouse? This is what he's wearing. You can see the toys over there. You see how it has the double eyes? This is the thing. See? Birdie. And uh, Grimace. This is a toy. <laughs> This is a toy! Cactus played flea market. I have the box somewhere else. I try to stay up to date with, with culture, guys. Okay? Thank you very much. But I remember... Oh, there it is! The flea market right over there. I remember. It's so fascinating how our fast food is really popular also worldwide. It's pretty interesting. I do find that uh, pretty interesting. But it was a big deal. It, re it was. So you can kind of make fun of me all you want, but it was a big deal that happened over here. But <clears throat> going back to what I was saying before, this right here, I am, so I don't know if some, most of you know this, if you're in the stream often, but if you're watching on YouTube, you may not know. This thing over here. You so him walking around over here, I'm finding more and more enjoyable. Uh, oh, you don't have McDonald's anymore. Uh, oh, I think I might know what you're referring to. I think I know what you're referring to. Okay, I got it. I got it. No, I get it. I get it. And yet again, this happened way before. I know what you're referring to. But this happened early last year. Um, the So I'm watching K-dramas. And I've also watched... Um, I've also watched... Uh, I've watched Moving. I've watched Parasite the Grey. I've watched... Parasite the movie, uh, I'm watching Goblin, and, you know, this is kind of funny, I've, like, you know how, like, all the movies that, like, all the big blockbuster movies are always stereotypically, you know, taking place in America, like, when there's an alien invasion, where does the, where do the aliens make contact, where do the aliens make contact in every movie, it's like, there's the whole globe, but it always happens in America, it's like nothing happens anywhere else in the world except America, right? Like, it's always that. Uh, <laughs> but, or specifically New York. <laughs> yeah. 
But it always happens in New York or always in America. Like it happens in some desert in Texas or Nevada. It happens in California, but it almost always happens in New York. If New York, like if the movies were like a real thing and New York was really the way that it was, no one would want to live there because there's always some sort of natural disaster that's ha- natural or supernatural disaster that's always happening in New York. But seeing this, like the city in the music video, but also seeing like the sweeping shots of uh, of like the city in like moving, like but moving isn't so much like you 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 see more of like the like uh, more like how would you I don't know how to say it like suburbs kind of area like with the mom and pop shops which we don't have anymore in America because they've all been driven out by bigger businesses but like seeing the city here not New York and seeing the you know city in like Parasite the Grey which is a horror uh horror show in in Korea but also seeing uh Parasite the movie where you have the the ritzy location with the upper class family and uh and and then the lower class family living in 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 that in the in in a non upper class area. I enjoy seeing this stuff, which is why I like this visualizer so much because you can see now you don't get to see everything, but like you you get to see how like the city looks in different places other than your LAs and New Yorks. Like I like this stuff. It's interesting, and it's it's. They have phenomenal trash cans. I'm just like, th- actually, that kind of stands out to me because the trash cans in America are garbage. I wouldn't even want to touch that button because it's probably been whatever. I just find this stuff fascinating. I really do. And isn't this the album cover? Isn't this the album cover? If I remember correctly. And it, uh, there's another album cover. Uh, wasn't there another album cover? That happens later on in the, in the visualizer? Did I see the new trash cans in Seoul? I have not. This is the album cover. For one of them at least. Because there's two versions. The, di- the dichotomy in urban landscape. Yeah. Yeah. I just find this stuff fascinating. I'd love to visit visit Seoul. Probably a lot safer than New York, although I don't know. But probably. They didn't have trans- trash cans on the street because of aesthetics. <laughs> really? I guess. Well, they probably don't have a gigantic littering problem like everywhere else. Isn't this the album cover for the other one? Maybe. Also, I really... He has Spongebob. Um, I don't remember. Uh, statues. He's got these uh, the bear things as well. Fascinating. I do think this, all this stuff is very cool. Seeing the background. He's pretty serious in this picture, though. There's a Supreme logo. Oh, there it is. Cactus Jack again right there. Yeah. It's pretty interesting seeing all this stuff in the background. You get to pick up on all these little things. I thought that I thought this was Teddy Fresh for a second. I, I think it's just color blocking. Normal color blocking. Good visualizer. I always find it fascinating. I always like looking at these kinds of things. It's pretty cool. And you can tell that he's having a good time in this music video. You can tell he's having a good time in this music video with his uh, with his boys in the background. I enjoyed it quite a bit. Did I read somewhere that Korea is strict on trash? Like, you get fined if you have too much trash waste? I wouldn't be surprised. Bro, you don't want to see the trash in New York. Bro, there's trash in the streets. There's legitimate just straight-up bags of garbage everywhere. It's so bad. <sighs> but, you know, it is what it is. Different different cities, different countries have different cultures. And, you know, people have kind of become accustomed to that in New York. I'm not the biggest fan of it, but... It is what it is. <sighs> All right. Thank you for being a part of this uh, reaction dissection of Neuron, the visualizer by J Hope. Phenomenal song. We're not going to get into the New York rats, okay? We actually have a mascot, Pizza Rat. We're not going to get into that. Thank you, Army, for being a part of this reaction to the visualizer of Neuron. 
I'll see y'all in the next one. Bora hey. Bing, uh, bingo. I don't know what I was going with. Pizza Rat. He's a national treasure. That's how I'm going to end the video. Pizza Rat, he's a national treasure. I'm going to end the video like that. What do you mean, ew?